My name is Elke Lechner and I have been working in London as a secondary teacher, uh, mostly in the inner city. I had a small heart attack last October. When I had uh, my small heart attack, I started off with cardio training at the Royal London Hospital and the Whitechapel Gym. And I was very determined to get well very soon. And the staff appreciated and respected that and acknowledged it and offered me TickerFit and said, would you be interested in using TickerFit? And I said, absolutely, when they explained to me what it is, because it will give me the independence to work in my own time. And also I was very keen to go back as fast as possible to the workforce. And when I started at the hospital, the step test was done and I failed it. And I've been always, I've always been a flat egg and a, and, a, and a sporty person. And I thought I can do this in a short amount of time with my mindset and physical exercises, it will be possible that I can go back um, quite soon to work. The TickerFit is a program where you will have visuals, videos in regards to your health. It will explain how you can mentally look after yourself, how you can look after your body through food intake. And it also has a section where you can do exercises. And these are controlled by staff. So the staff will still look after you and give feedback how you're going. And it's actually quite nice to get that SMS well done. And you can also check out on your own and see how you are progressing. Now, flexibility, independence, and um, to be confident. Well, I like the flexibility of, of the app because I can use the, the, the app um, or I could use it because I was gradually going back to work. It was scaffolded that I could actually use the app after work independently in my own time. Uh, another, another very big point is I remember when I did the step test that was in, in a room with other clients and I felt quite embarrassed because as I said before I've always been a sporty person and thought how did this happen and I feel in using the app you can actually use it in your in your own home and then build up your strengths and then um, when you feel comfortable join a group. I personally feel that it has the flexibility that I can actually do this program on my own in my own time. That is really a, a great benefit of it. And also, as I mentioned before, that it will uh, install your confidence because um, some people are shy. They don't want to be with other people. And especially after you have, uh, a heart condition and you're not really able to move the way you used to, then I think it's, it's a really um, good way to gain your confidence again before you go into the public. It is very important to, to keep up your exercises that your heart still recovers and becomes healthy again, that I can actually withstand the pressure of life and whatever comes along. And to be able to do that, you have to, I feel I have to go 
through this change, this life change, and include exercise as if I would be brushing my teeth or eating breakfast or eating lunch um, to prevent that I'll have another heart attack because it doesn't stop there during eight weeks of cardio training and being able to walk up the staircases again. It is a whole process which will last practically until I die. Downloading the app was very easy. You put in your email address, you get a password. In my case, the staff at the hospital helped me to set it up and also explain how the app works. So in that regards, um, I felt it was easy to use. Sometimes when I tried to go to the next step, say from the warm-up period into the middle part of the exercises, I had some difficulties that it wouldn't load. And in that case, I would just restart my phone and then um, it was always possible then to go to the next section. The healthcare team discussed and explained the app to me, which was really great. And also, I personally feel there has to be that connection of the team with you. I mean, I was in a position that I had a very small heart attack, but I'm aware that there are other patients who really have more severe difficulties to move. And in that regard, it's absolutely crucial that they are connected to staff. And also while you are exercising, that you do have your heart spray on you just in case. Because I had the heart attack in October last year, I decided during the last three weeks in London that I needed to be with my family back in Australia during the pandemic. And at this stage, I'm in isolation in Sydney and waiting to be released to be reunited with my family. I have been using TikaFit nearly daily, uh, sometimes in the morning, other times, depending what I'm doing in the afternoon. And I really make the attempt to use it at least once daily. It's very important for me because I'm confined in this space. Um, I cannot leave, the, leave my room. And it is also a way that I'm actually able to be physical and move. So it's part of looking after myself. So for me at this stage, it's crucial. And I actually typed out and wrote out the exercises and, and it's different having a piece of paper in front of you. I really prefer that I can still use the app and I was actually able to download it over here because I thought I had lost it. It is very crucial if you had a heart condition that to understand that this is life-changing and if you want to prevent another heart attack you cannot go back to the way you lived before the heart attack there has to be some change and part of that change is that you do physical exercises on a daily basis pretty much on a daily basis, that you have a certain amount set aside to look after your body. And not just after your body, TikaFit, as I said before, has also a section about food, your mental health, and that is really important that people can access that. I like to say a big thing 
thank you to the Royal London Hospital, to the cardio department there, and also to the staff who ran the cardio program at the Whitechapel gym. Without the team and the efforts, I would have not been able to go that fast back to work. And also a big thank you to the doctors who looked after me during that time. It was quite difficult without having family or friends visiting me in London. And yeah, I just, I'm very thankful and I really love to share my experiences about Ticker Fit to give back in that way. Thank you. Mm -hmm.